Welcome back to 5 Minute Knives, the channel that loves it when people can make their own stuff. And today, we're going to talk about this snazzy little EDC tray I've been using for the last couple of weeks, made by my friends over at Tactician Trays. But first, let's sell you guys one of my custom sheaths. And we're back! Okay, hopefully you guys bought some custom sheaths, and today we're gonna talk about Tactician Trays. That's what this is. This is a tray from Tactician Trays, and on Instagram you can find them at Tactician underscore Trays. Got that? Good. And before we get started, I just wanna thank my friends over at Blade Ops for sending me a bunch of stuff. Really cool of them. They're sending me knives in the future to review for you guys, so let's go ahead and thank them. Link's in the description if you wanna buy anything. And yes, that does help me out, so very, very cool. And I'd also like to thank indexthermoplastics.com for sending me this awesome dragon scale kydex you're seeing in the background here. I'm gonna be using that on a few of my sheaths in the future. And if it works out really nicely, I think you guys have uh, will definitely like dig the result. I will show you how they look when I make one out of them, but for right now, it's just the background for my video here. And I do appreciate the guys over at indexthermoplastics.com. Okay, let's get into it. So to review this tray, I kind of have a top-down view here, and I'm gonna be rolling in footage from some different angles. Here's some now. And as you can see, this is a, uh, a wood background here, and he has uh, etched my logo, the 5 Minute Knives logo into it, and I greatly appreciate that. This backing is a magnet, and it's actually fairly strong, but it can be a little bit finicky. For example, um, here's my Endura. I can place this here, and it will stick. A little bit stronger in the middle, I believe. And then here's my Streamlight, Micro Stream, and this, it will stick as well, but it likes to be stuck to the clip a little bit better. Uh, same thing with these guys here. So just get used to how to use the, the magnet properly and see, look, like what things like to stick and what things don't. Boom, we're good. So it, it is handy, it is nice. So my favorite aspect of this thing is the phone charger here. And as you can see, I plop this in like so and we get a green light. My phone is charging. Right now it's at 63%. And this charger is actually pretty quick. Again, one of the quirks of this thing is if you have a really thick uh, phone case, it may not charge as effectively. So you want to keep that in mind. But with this particular case, this kind of thin guy here, as you can see, it charges very well. And again, we're at 63% right now. I will give you guys an update in a bit where we're at. It charges very, very quickly, but uh, this tray in particular came with a blue leather backing here that you can kind of peel up Which is very very nice as far as your mechanism is concerned There is a wooden post here, which you know, I worry about breaking that in the future You just got to be kind of delicate with it and what I do with my IWB holsters as you can see I have a clip right there and that if I can do this on camera, just kind of sinks into that. So now my mechanism is off to the side. I keep a spare mag right next to it. My wallet, of course, from 511. I do have a watch here, my G-Shock. I keep an Athena coin and some O'Keefe's lip balm. But I've been using this thing for the last couple of weeks now, ever since he sent it. And I have to say, I freaking love it. It's really kind of giving me like a nice spot to just kind of plop all my stuff. No, you can't fit a ton of stuff on it. And yes, you have to keep it organized, but it's not really a hardship. If anything, this is really nice. Um, you know, the chick I'm seeing came over and she was commenting how nice it was. I really love the phone charging aspect. Uh, this particular charger, I can kind of unplug and it works with a lot of my other stuff, which I appreciate. I really love the backing and this, uh, this backing here is set at an angle. Very, very nice, easy to assemble handmade here in the US, tactician underscore trays. Guys, go ahead and support this guy. He's a cool guy. At minimum, give him a follow on Instagram. I like this dude a lot. And inquire about your own tray. He can customize them. He can make these any way you want. Let him know what you're trying to fit on there and I'm sure he can work with you. But this is my tray. I'm very, very happy with it. Brother, thank you so much for sending this. this. is very kind of you, and it is a worthy video for the channel. I think you guys probably all need a solution for this kind of stuff. Everybody's throwing their stuff in a drawer or on a shelf or something. This really does make the wives happy, too. I'll tell you that. Like, they really like that you're organized. The stuff's in one spot. It looks really cool. Your mechanism is really easy to get a hold of. I can draw from this position. It's just nice, man. Like, this whole thing is nice. I really appreciate it. And it looks a little cluttered right now because all the stuff I keep on it, but it's not bad at all. Oh, man, I keep this like really really fairly neat uh, with the leather backing. It's cool You don't have to worry about scratching stuff 
I really like that my flashlight and my knife and then my little EDC stuff's over here on the magnet out of the way. And again, I mean, you can organize this however you want. This is just the way I do it. It's not a big deal. How nice is this? Let's hear it in the comments for like just how cool this thing is. And I'm sure most of you need a solution. So that's my two cents. Tactician underscore trays. Go ahead and shoot him a message for a quote of your custom EDC tray. I'm sure you won't be disappointed. I'm pretty picky with this stuff and I'm really happy. And then right now we're at 67%. So we went up 4% already. So that's pretty freaking cool if you ask me. This thing works very quickly. And again, this is with a case on it. So that's pretty cool. And I hope you guys appreciate the review. Uh, go ahead and check him out. Throw him a follow at minimum. And then also let him know in the comments what you thought and how well he did on these. They're very, very cool. What a neat design. I'll let you know how it holds up long term. But the first two weeks has really revolutionized how I, you know, pocket dump at the end of the day. So if you're anything like me, you've been looking for a solution for a long time. I just kind of stumbled on this guy's page and I'm really glad I did because we're becoming friends. He's a good guy. So go ahead and support him and go ahead and order your tray today. I'll see you guys next time on 5 Minute Knives.